All right, folks, let's check the Ask Frank message bank, and let's see uh, if anyone asked me any good questions here. Yeah, there, Frankie. This is uh, Billy G, man. Uh, I'm a big Hillary Clinton supporter, and I, uh, I don't see what you're doing, man. What are you trying to do? You're trying to hurt Hillary. I don't get it. She has lots of experience with the State Department. So <laughs> I guess my question is, my question to you, Frank Barris, uh -huh. is uh, Hillary Clinton has all this experience as the Secretary of State, how do you counteract that uh, just as some homeless guy? Uh, please answer me. Well, um, I guess the best answer is I'm not just some homeless guy. I'm a homeless presidential candidate. As for Hillary Clinton's uh, experience, let's think about this for a moment. She supported the Iraq War. Uh, it took her about a decade to admit that was even a mistake. Uh, did she learn her lesson? Oh, heck no. She advocated for the overthrow of Muammar Gaddafi in Libya. And what happened there? Well, the predictable thing, the country was thrown into chaos. Um, all of their weapons and, and treasure went to ISIS. Good job there, Hillary. Too bad you didn't learn your lesson from the Iraq war. But did she learn her lesson from the, the debacle in Libya? No, because she's absolutely, totally advocating we do the same thing in Syria. She advocates now for the overthrow of Assad in Syria. And already just trying to overthrow Assad in Syria? 10 million refugees have been spread across the world. It's a global disaster, and she supports continuing it. So if this is her experience in foreign policy, I think there's a problem there. And I don't think people want a woman who, will, who wants to start World War III in Syria. Russia has said they will defend Syria, and Hillary Clinton wants to overthrow Assad. So that puts us at the precipice of World War III, and I don't think that's a good idea. That's just me. So our choices in this election are we can vote for Donald Trump, who will accidentally start World War III. We can vote for Hillary Clinton, who will intentionally start World War III. Or you can write in Frank Barish, because I promise you, I will not start World War III. That's my oath, my, my promise to you, America. You have my word on this. And I'm the only major candidate. I know there's other candidates. There's the other, you know, Green Party, Libertarian. But they're party candidates, and their parties have a ceiling. People are never going to vote for a Libertarian or a Green. I'm independent. I have no party ceiling because I'm independent. Oh, yeah. So everyone can vote for me, and everyone... It, you know, by November, I think pretty much everyone's going to want to vote for me because I'm the guy who won't start World War III. That's right, America. I promise. Okay, it looks like there's another question here. There's another question here on the voicemail for Ask Frank Anything. Ask Frank Anything. Let's see what this one is. Frankie, this is the Why? Why are you always embarrassing the family? <laughs> it's not embarrassing. It's... You know, I love Frankie. Bernie Sanders too. We love Bernie Sanders. Yeah. <laughs> Why are you running for president when you know we all have Bernie Sanders? Frankie, please answer the question, Frankie. You come home for dinner. Whatever you kids. I love you. I love you too. Bye, yeah, bye. Okay, that was Aunt Jeannie. Uh, she wants to know why on earth, you know, when Bernie Sanders is awesome, why I would be running for president. That's because Bernie Sanders isn't going to be on the ballot in November. Everyone knows this. The Democratic Party has pulled out all the stops for Hillary Clinton, cheated in a number of states. I mean, come on now. The exit polling in Arizona was 33 points off the official results. Exit polling, 33 points. 33, 33 percentage points off. That's, in, that's unheard of. Exit polling more than two percentage points off triggers recounts around the world. But here in America, when it helps Hillary Clinton, it just gets swept under the rug. So uh, that's why I'm running, Aunt Jeannie, because Hillary Clinton cheated. Nobody likes her. Donald Trump is insane. Everyone's afraid of him. And there has to be a third option. So I'm running for president. Oh, yeah, you know it's true. And I will be home for dinner. Thank you. Oh, yeah.